Hello, welcome to HT. Come on in, but don't forget to sanitize your hands first. I'm Maya, I'm in grade 11, and I'm a part of SHIELD. Hi, I'm Jacob, and I'm in grade 9. Hey, my name is Jasmine, I'm also in grade 11, and I'm a part of SHIELD. Hi everyone, this is Maya taking over the voiceover, and here we go as we head into the attendance office. So over here, as you walk in, you have the attendance secretary's desk, as well as the vice principal's offices. And first, we're going to head into Mrs. Vazil's office. Hi there, my name is Mrs. Vassil. I'm one of the vice principals here at Holy Trinity, and I look after students whose last names fall between the letters L to Z. I look forward to seeing all of you in September. And now we're gonna head into Mr. DiMuzio's office. Hi everyone, I'm Mr. DiMuzio. I'm one of the vice principals here. Can't wait to meet you guys in September. I look after last names Alpha, Ada K, and I'm excited to have you coming. Go Titans. And now we're going to head into the main office. And as we go in here to the right, we have our principal, Ms. Halich's office. Hello and welcome. I'm Mrs. Josie Halich, and I'm the principal of Holy Trinity Catholic Secondary School. I would like to take this opportunity to thank our future Titans, parents and guardians for joining us this evening for the virtual grade eight parent information evening. I look forward to meeting you and welcoming you to the Holy Trinity family someday very soon. I hope you enjoy the presentation and I encourage you to reach out to the school if you have any questions or any way that we can help you. Thank you. All right, and now we're going to head around the atrium. We're starting off with our cosmetology room. And in the Cosmo room, you might have grade 10 Cosmo as well as grade 11 hairstyling and aesthetics. And this room is really cool. It has many different places where you can style hair as well as um, different stations and different materials to help you um, achieve the best of your ability. And now we're heading down the atrium into our theater section. So here we have our community board as well as our stage door and our ticket booth. And then of course, the beautiful theater. There are two doors to the theater. We're going into the right door right now. And as we head down the aisle, there's a bit of a downward slope, but these are all of the different seats as well as the stage over here. And in here, we may have different presentations as well as our theater plays um, when the time may be. And going back into the atrium, we head into our cafeteria. Now in the cafeteria, it's a little bit empty right now, but normally there's different tables set up as well as our main cafe in here where you can buy food, and drinks, and here's everything here as well as our checkout stations right there and then a door back into the main cafeteria now our cafeteria is super open and it has many different windows for a bunch of natural light which is really nice especially when you're eating lunch and here's everything here as well as our windows up to the second floor there and our different titan technology banners there and now we're heading back into the atrium and continuing on our right and over here we have the co-op office Hey guys, I'm Mr. Pillay, your student success teacher. And continuing along the atrium, we have our student store. And in the school store, um, during lunch times, they usually sell popcorn, which is always fun, and our business and marketing rooms. And then continuing along, we have guidance. And in the guidance office, um, as we walk in here, <laughs> they're pointing to the sign now, we have uh, Ms. Luciani at our at our desk there. there she Hi, is. How are you guys? <laughs> and then we have Ms. Latimer. Hi everybody, my name is Ms. Latimer. I'm the department head of student services here at Holy Trinity. We are so looking forward to welcoming you into the Holy Trinity family next September. Go Titans. Love you all. See you soon. Awesome. And as we head down our first floor hallways, we have our washrooms there to the left. And as we head into the West Corridor, we're now getting into the phys ed hallway. On our right, we have our change rooms coming up, but before that, we're gonna go to the left into the various gyms. So this is the first gym, this is gym one. And here it is, the divider is up right now, so it's got these separate spaces. 
And then we're heading into the second gym, but before that, that is the phys ed office over there. And this is gym two. It is half of the other gym, and there it is. And then as you head to the left here down the hallway, we see our change rooms there as well as some water fountains, the Titan Wall of Fame. And then to the left is our gym three, as we call it the small gym. And there it is in there. And continuing down the hallway to the left again, we have well more change rooms right there. And the football lockers, that's why they're a bit wider. And then we have an exit right there to the right, but continuing down our hallway, we head into the tech hallway. So we're starting over here with one of our construction tech rooms. I think this is the wood shop. Yep, here it is. Various equipments, and that is everything there. It's quite dusty in there, but it's very, very cool for sure. Heading down the hallway a little bit more, at the end of the hallway there, we have another one of our tech rooms. Before that, we're gonna go over here. And this is the auto shop. And there's everything. This is the transportation technology room where all of the cars are fixed. And this is a pretty cool hands-on class. So that is definitely really interesting. Continuing down, we have more water fountains as well as another construction tech room. It's similar to the first one, very spacious, lots of different equipments. And then there's another door to the gym right there. And now we're going into the weight room. So in the weight room, it's like a middle little gym. So here's everything there. We have a bench press, mirrors, different types of weights and equipments. And going down, we have another entrance to the gym to the left there. And continuing on, we have our special ed rooms as well as the athlete of the year wall. And then we're just at the back side of the gym right now. So to the left, there is another entrance. And now we're back into the main atrium right when we started. Okay, now we're going to floor number two. All right. Hey everyone, it's Jasmine taking over for the voiceover. And as Jake said, we are now on the second floor. Come along. Here we are entering into one of the coolest rooms in HT, room 201, Food and Nutrition. Our lovely food and nutrition teachers are Mrs. Joswa and Mrs. Vela. Here in this room, we actually have four kitchens. Uh, I personally took food and nutrition in grade nine and it was one of the most fun classes I had. And of course here we see our chairs and desks and a cool mirror to show us what we're cooking up today. Now as we leave the food and nutrition room, right across from it is our chapel. Here on the wall, we see our school mantra. And the chapel is just a really calming place uh, to come if you need a moment to yourself or if you want to pray to God. As we are a Catholic school, it's one of our most sacred rooms in our school and there's nothing quite like it. And on the left is the chaplain's office with Mrs. O'Connell. Now we're just walking down the hallway, and as we just visited the chapel, that means most of the rooms in this area are for religion class. As we turn the corner, on the left side are most of our tech rooms. And on the right, we have a window to one of our small gyms. And here is a beautiful artwork of our Trinity Tech Department. As we turn again, most of the classes on the left side of this hallway are for geography or history classes. Geography we take in grade 9 and history we take in grade 10. Now when you are in grade 9, most of our lockers will be on the second floor along with a mentor's locker from your family. And on the right side there, we just saw the male bathroom. And if you go a couple of steps forward, you will also have, of course, the female bathroom. Now on the left here, we have room 217, which is our tech design. And on the right here, we have our staff room and windows to our atrium below. And on the left are windows to our cafeteria. These two classes here at the end are also usually for geography class. Here we are approaching our school library. Our librarians are Mrs. Trousdale and Mrs. Boot. Let's enter. Shh. 
Now the library is currently running. You're just not allowed to go inside. And there's Mrs. Boot giving us a cute little wave. And in normal circumstances, you can use the library to sign out books, Chromebooks, use the printer, use the computers, which we see here on the inside of the library. And that was our school library and the entire second floor. All right, now we're going to floor number three. Maya taking over again as we head up to the third floor. And here we are, we have the art display case over here, and as well as the art rooms here on the right. And we're just heading into the second art room over here. This is Mr. Joseph's room. And here we are. They have lots of spacious art desks, as well as different materials. And the kiln room, we just passed it, it was just back there. And there is a lovely picture there. And continuing along back into the hallway. Now going back in the hallway, we have our music rooms coming up here on the right. And here's our music room. We're gonna start here on the left into this room. This is the first music room. And there is Mr. Stanley over there. We're gonna see him right now. <laughs> and there's the music storage room. We just passed that little door there on the left. And then there's a second music room on the right here. And it's very similar. Not doesn't have those steps, but it still has the different uh, blackboards. There's everything, and then we have our different uh, music exams room exam rooms in there where you might have your uh, music tasks or exams. And now heading down, so heading down this hallway. This um, hallway has different rooms. You might have religion in here. You might have Italian. It kind of varies based on the teacher. So as we head down, as you can see those open doors there on the left that we're heading up to now, those are the washrooms. And then there's a water fountain there. And then all of these lockers are usually for grade 10 students because we are on the third floor now. So continuing down, on the right we have um, some more doors going out to the portables as well as a little display case there. And now we're heading into our tech hallway and some of our science labs. And then to the right here, we have some science labs. But in the back there, we have our science lab benches. And then of course, just your regular classroom. And that's Mr. Orlansky there. And as we head out back in the hallway, there you can see some of our computer labs there. Like I said, that's where we have some of our business courses. You also may have uh, civics and careers over there. And now as we turn left down this hallway, we're heading into our math and science rooms. So all down this hallway, we have a lot of um, labs on the uh, left here. And then on the right, you might have math or as well as science. <laughs> and then also in this hallway is our green screen room. You might have English in there or media. And here it is. So it's a pretty spacious room in here. We have a lot of Mac desktops. This is where you'll find a lot of the cameras, as well as our green screen, obviously. And then, yeah, it just kind of serves as another computer lab. It's also the yearbook room. So heading back out in the hallway, we've reached the end, but it should be noted that at the end of the hallway on the left here is the elevator. Now the elevator is not to be used uh, for just regular students. Uh, you must have a disability or an elevator pass because you're injured. So there's that. And now continuing down, we're gonna go into what we call the secret hallway as we turn left here. And in here is just uh, three or four rooms where you might have uh, French or English. So there's different rooms over here. And then as well as our uh, windows on the right here. There are various windows that go down into the atrium so you can see, and we're gonna look at that right now. 
There we go. Down into the atrium from the third floor. And that concludes our third floor as we head to the end of the hallway here. And here's our great HT football field. Thank you for coming along with us. See you in September.